Kim, how are you? Good, how are you doing, bro? Yeah. Okay, this is uh, oh. Vic's wife, Kim. Okay, Kim, you, you don't even know it, but we decided to do a new uh, travel, like a video log. Huh? It's called a vlog, right? Yeah. And uh, this is the first episode, and it's actually the first episode in a whole new vlogging series called The World's Worst Vlog. Okay, fantastic. Right? Now, there's probably <laughs> some other guy out there that's already laid claim to it. <laughs> yeah. But so this might be the world's second most worst vlog. See, I can't even get it right, so that's why it's so bad. So what's, what's on the plan today? Uh, oh, my plan? <laughs> I don't know. I'm heading to Point Loma. I think you guys are going to the Salton Sea. Mm, that's right. So, uh, off to the next part of the day, we're heading out to uh, the Salton Sea, and uh, we'll explain more about that on our way. Okay, you ready to go? I'm ready to go. Let's... So, Vic, I noticed that uh, you're driving a BMW. What uh, model is this? This is a BMW 128i. Right. Convertible, so it's just a fun little California kind of car. So we're going to take this all the way out to the Salton Sea, which is just uh, about a two and a half hour drive. Well, maybe in the BMW, it's maybe about an hour and a half and it's located just south of Palma Springs, so it's out in the desert and it's got a really, really interesting story. I should mention at this point too that uh, uh, even though we mentioned the BMW, we're not actually being sponsored by BMW, right? No. And they haven't made any payments to us at all, but it's a fantastic car. You know, but if they wanted to throw something our way, like, I don't know, some stickers even, or... Uh, Key fob. Yeah, or if they wanted to sponsor uh, the world's uh, worst blog, um, you know, we welcome that. Just so you know, we are not promoting it in any way. It's just a great, really great yeah, little no, car. Yeah, just a fun car. Yeah, okay, let's go, Vic. Off okay, we go. Okay, here we go. Okay, we're going to put the top down here. All right, now that we got the top down, I think we're ready to head off to the Salton Sea. We certainly are. which is also known as Top Gun. They do have an amazing air show there once a year that's pretty spectacular. Because I can't believe that you two characters want to go to Top Gun. I got to give you your dream shot. I'm going to send you up against the best. You two characters are going to Top Gun. I think I screwed that up. Oh, yeah, that sounded good, Brad. That was believable. You were a character on that. Yeah. Uh, we're on our way to the Salton Sea, but uh, we passed this sign and it said that there's a tasting today at the Ramona Wine Ranch. So just another interesting stop here. Southern California, I'm finding, Beck, is just loaded with all kinds of uh, really interesting features and surprises. So. Yeah, it really is. It's always, yeah. it never ends the excitement. Yeah, okay, so we're going to go try some wine here at the Ramona Wine Ranch. There's the tasting over here. This is Kimberly from the from Ramona Wine Ranch. Yep, Ramona Winery. And I was born and bred here in Ramona. My family friends here own this wonderful winery. Uh, we make amazing wine here grown all out the, throughout the valley. Right. As you can see here, we grow about two acres worth of 
crop here on site, um, yeah. and then we'll purchase from friends and um, yeah. uh, colleagues around here in the valley to complete our product line. Let's go try some wine. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Thanks. Okay, Brad, so which so, one is this one? This is the, the burlesque. The very first one on the list called burlesque. So burlesque. Okay, remind us again what's the burlesque all about. So the burlesque is made with our so orange muscat, muscat so cannelli, and our symphony. <laughs> Brad is actually a wine expert. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I only know Been drinking like. wine a long time, huh? <laughs> it's actually very nice, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty fruity. I mean, it's really great on the nose. Mm -hmm. But no, it's nice. It's very light, though. Mm -hmm. Is that yeah. right? What yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 It's made to be that afternoon sip on the patio. I would try that. Yeah. Okay. So would you like to have a little bit I of I think you gotta try it. You gotta try so it. So I'll try yeah. it. Sure. All right, perfect. So the Viognier for you, sir. Yeah, okay. And I'll wait on you. So most Chardonnays are put through ML to give mm. them that buttery quality. Right. As well as oaking them. Mm. Oh, good. Hi, Terry. Hey. Oh, hey. Sorry, we're filming. No, that's okay. <laughs> that's all right. There I have to have your makeup. Oh, okay. So you're, are you okay if we film a little bit? Yeah. You must be the owner. Yeah. I recognize you from your photo. Yeah. I'm, just... I'm Brad. Hi, Brad. What we're, are you guys filming for? Uh, for fun. We saw your sign and... And uh, uh, this is already one of the best stops we've had. So, oh, yeah, yeah you're welcome. Really your wines are fantastic. Hi, I'm Terry at Ramona Ranch Winery, and we started our winery back in 2005 just for fun and um, started making wine, made a great little Zinfandel from Ramona, won the largest amateur wine competition in the world. Wow. And from Hatfield Creek, I highly encourage you guys to visit. They're just a mile down the road and she's from Canada. Okay. And then um, we both decided to go commercial. We consistently win double gold best of show for our state wines. We're, next, we're gonna try the, uh... What, what is it? Remind the San Giovese. Right? San Giovese. That's, yeah. that's a state, so it's yeah. grown here. If yeah. we're in Italy, we would call it a Brunello. Oh, right, okay. So it's a little bit heavier than your typical San Giovese. Right, okay. And that is um, a state. And when wine is called a state, that means it's just grown on the property, processed on the property, made on the property, never oh, okay. actually leaves. I actually never knew that before. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you for that. Yeah. yeah. How does it smell, Brad? How does that? Well, You know, Terry, this is delicious. Thank you. I'm no, pretty like, proud of that. No, like really, this is, yeah. I love Italian wines and. Well, you guys have to come back and visit us in the fall when we release our Alionico. Oh, okay, and what is that? It's a very rare Italian wine. Well, there's nobody's, yeah, okay. <laughs> Nobody else is making it around here. I think there's yeah. less than 60 acres in the United States. Okay, so here we go. <laughs> this, one. this is beautiful, mm. isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. You know I love this flower, it's my favorite. Yeah, was oh, I'm going to show you something if you're not in a hurry. And I texted you. I would check the base cabinet okay. in the laundry room. Nice to meet you guys. Thank you, Sherry. This is a lovely wine. Everything is locally grown. So as you were driving through Ramona, you probably noticed quite a few vineyards off of the highway. Look at mm. Rose. Um, not everyone has a tasting room like us. Right. And so they'll grow and yeah. they'll sell the grapes to winemakers that have tasting rooms and need a full product one. Like you don't have to finish so that, Vic, if you're worried about, if you're worried about driving. You right. can, you can, no, you don't have to. No, 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 I, I actually, okay. I'm a safe driver, so oh, let's go like that. Okay, a responsible That was driver. very tasty. Because we're gonna try the Super Tuscan next. So I'm getting six for me to ship back home to Canada. Uh, one for uh, Russ and Marina, who are gonna join us tomorrow yeah. night. One. And then one for the house, and uh, and uh, that's because uh, Kim is now. Uh, we've signed you up, Kim, as part of the <laughs> wine club here. You didn't at the, know it. At but... the uh, Ramona Ranch uh, Wine Club. Hey, the girls. Thanks a lot. Hey. Enjoy. That was a lot of fun. Thanks we got some really coming. great wine here at the. Uh... You know, I ended up with more than I bargained for there, Vic. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Anyway, what a great stop. Highly recommended stopping at the Ramona Wine Ranch. Yeah, sounds fantastic. Okay, we're back on track here. That was a total side trip there that we did not expect, but that's uh, that's one of the fun things about uh, going on a road trip. Yeah. Okay, so we're just coming out of Ramona. And uh, we're going to a place to have lunch now called J 
Jeremy's on a hill, which is just outside of Julian, California. And as we're going up into the hills or the mountains, we're into some snow here, so. We're rolling. <laughs> oh, okay, so this is the burlesque wine from uh, Ramona Valley Ranch that we picked up yesterday uh, after we met the owner there, Terry. Terry. And, uh, Cheers to Terry. Kimberly. Well, and Kimberly, who helped us out there and helped us pick it out. The Ramona Ranch burlesque uh, white wine. Okay, so all right. we're all trying it here for the first time, and we want to get everybody's feelings on what this is, because right. I think it's excellent. Cheers, Cheers everybody. Cheers. Cheers. Smell that bouquet, isn't it pretty? Yeah. Pretty pretty. Pretty. Nice. Isn't that nice? Oh, that's like right. Nice. It's actually like made that. like I mean, like just an hour yeah. west or east here. Right? I would drink that. I would right? totally drink that. 